Hello everyone, Ryan here with a short tutorial about how to trash or archive a single chapter or multiple chapters and how to unarchive or untrash those if you need to. The simplest way to do this for a single chapter, for example, if I want to trash or archive this one annotations Adam Fritz, I hit these three dots and say archive chapter and it will tell you that it's going to be archived and you can always find it by unarchiving in the project settings button. So you see, it's now gone. So that's trashing or archiving a single chapter. Now remember, this isn't deleted, it's just put somewhere out of the project session so you never lose any work by accident. Now, to do this for multiple chapters, you can click this archive chapters button up here or down in the project settings, archive project or chapters down here. So let's say we want to archive all of these duplicates here. Archive chapters, and then click each of these buttons. And notice that it turns into recover. So that other single chapter is up here recoverable as well. So that's how the archive and recover chapters function works. Uh, it's the same as trashing it, but it's just, again, so that you never lose any work by accident. If you don't have permissions to archive for whatever reason, because of where you're working on a team, the best thing to do to get rid of a chapter that's in the way. So for example, let's do that. Now say that you don't want this Adam Fritz file in here but you don't have permission to do the archive function, all you have to do is drag it down to the end, and then at least all of your timestamps and your chapters will be in order. And that's how that process works.